Hi and welcome to the Azam Sharp YouTube channel. I'm your host Mohamed Azam and in this screencast I'm going to show you that how you can use iOS plot to create pie charts. Um, in the previous screencast we learned how to create line charts and uh, well the next one is pie charts which is very important right? So let's first look at the pie chart data. Um, so and this is of course if you go to GitHub and search for iOS plot you can download the whole project and in the sample data folder you will find this file which contains sample data for pie chart. The pie chart data is much more uh, I would say self-explanatory. You can see that there's a key and the the value is basically an array of dictionaries and each of the dictionary will have title and the value, title and value, title and value and the value is of course the value that you want to plot. Um, whatever value you provide it doesn't matter because it will take out it will plot with 100% in mind okay which means that if you provide over here 40 okay and you can see that all these values when you add up it's more than 100 so it's going to figure out what is the percentage of 40 between all of these if you add these up and then the the percentage of 40 will be displayed okay let's Let's go ahead and it's pretty much the self-explanatory code. Uh, we're creating the chart using PC pie chart. You can see the, the width and the height that we are providing, uh, setting the diameter, setting the color label, uh, adding the chart to the basically the sub view or the main view sub view. And then of course it's checking that if it is we are running it on the iPad, which we are, uh, then it's going to increase the size of the title font and the percentage font. Okay. Over here we are just going to check in the bundle file that we are going to get the data of the sample file. Once we get the sample we get the data. Uh, we search for the key which is data and then um, we get the item and then from the item we can get the title and the value that we want to plot. Over here we have different colors that are applied to it. Uh, if it's zero which is the loop is running and if the loop index is zero then we apply the yellow color if one uh, it will apply green color so this is just to make sure that each of the slices that are being displayed on the screen are of different color so if I run this you will see it will create a graph um, and the good thing is that it actually points out that which color is uh, I mean which percentage or this slice is actually 44.4 percent and I believe if you add all of these together it should add up to 100 percent um, and that's pretty much it I, I think the the pie chart graph created by iOS plot it really looks nice and um, you know it's very easy to use so once again if you have needs for creating a simple pie chart uh, then you should definitely take a look at iOS plot it makes it very easy to create these kinds of pie chart and line charts and to download that, uh, let me go over here. Um, you can download, you can go to github.com and then search for iOS plot and you can download uh, this particular library. Okay. And it will have all the code and everything. So I hope you like this small screencast. It's, of course, uh, based on the first one, which is creating the line chart. So I highly recommend that you watch that one in which I went into great detail explaining every aspect of how to create the line chart using iOS plot and uh, as you have seen creating a pie chart is almost very similar yet a um, little bit more easier than creating a line chart. So that's pretty much it. Thank you very much and stay tuned for more videos.